but everyone's here. Watch and talk to our camera. All right, welcome back, guys. So I'm gonna be What's double uploading this week. That's Ethan back there. I'm double uploading this week. We have this kid over here. He's flipping me off. Um, so this week. Over the video, I'm pretty sure that this week's video is gonna be the headlights. Um, so this video is gonna be like uploaded three days after. We're just doing an oil change for some of you guys that don't know how to jack the car. We'll show you guys how we jacked it, how we changed the oil, and uh, see if it's an easy process. I'll let you know prior to the video if it's not, so you guys won't start it. All right, guys. So I'll right tell now, you what. what you, we, hit, you hit my truck, and I'll, I'll, I'll rip your whole front end off. The insurance will pay. All, All right, guys. You, you heard that threat. My truck was still All right. Better. So what we did is that we put the so I, this little jack wouldn't work. We had to get a low profile jack, and we put the low profile jack toward the middle. There's a jacky point right down there. Um, so the center of the car, we just jacked it there and then put on two jack stands. We left the low profile jack there. Oh, by the way guys, Ethan's going to show me how to do this. It's my first time, so he's got this. Take over. I've only ever changed American muscle. I have a 1965 Ford F100. So this crap's totally new to me. So if this is your first time doing it, it's all our first time doing it. We're in this together, guys. So step one, you're going to come over here. This is your oil cap. What you're gonna do, only gonna twist it once like this, then you flip it. It's weird like that. The Germans are some crazy mofos. Now your oil cap's open. You wanna assure you do this first, so that way when we take off the drain plug on the bottom, there's gonna be a better flow, it'll come out easier, and everyone's happy. What you wanna do is before you climb under the car, because you only wanna climb under it once, you don't want it to come in and out, that's too much work. So what you wanna do is get everything you need while you're down there out. For the BMWs, I believe it was a 17 millimeter rent socket wrench. Then we've got a five gallon oil pan, but since this is six and a half quarts of oil, we're also gonna use a Halloween bucket because that's the bee's knees right there. All right guys, so we're using Castrol Edge as the oil that we're using. Um, it's, I, I just heard a lot of people use this. It's better, it's not really, it's primarily for BMW and a couple other cars. So we're just using this to be on the safe side and uh, we're using this random uh, filter I got off of eBay that everyone else uses. So. Oh plus, my god. <laughs> plus we're I know what you're gonna want to do. You wanna put something under behind the wheels so that way it doesn't fall back on you. Because then what's gonna happen is you're gonna be under the car, you're gonna get crushed, you're gonna die, it's gonna be a bad time. No one wants to have that. Oh, oh, Alright, it's right here. And your socket, your little your fun toy is not gonna work. How is it not gonna work? It's just not gonna fit. It's too small? Yeah, no, it's 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 right here. Yeah. And it's, you got a jack stand and everything else in the way. Okay, so give it to me and I got you. You need like a regular socket wrench. I got you, I got you. I'm really uncomfortable down here. Oh, God. Yeah. Okay, guys. So, usually there's a little flap right here. Um, but you kick the flap down and then there's your, here's your drain plug right here. You getting all this? Yeah. Good job. Uh, but Norse car is a piece of junk, so it already okay, broke. Okay, we're not adding that in. <laughs> we're not. <laughs> Come well, on, you're buddy. BMW haters. Bloopers. <laughs> you drop it about two sizes. And we'll start with that. I need to figure out. Okay, so that's tightening. No, this is it. Really? It should be. Alright, that's the hell Good guess, buddy. If I can get it off. Make sure when it's loose, yo, you have the thing under it. Okay. It's gonna pour all over my jack stand, doesn't matter. Really? Mm -hmm. I don't want it on the, the carpet and the floor. It's gonna happen, buddy. No, whoa, whoa, it's not gonna happen. It's uh, coming! <laughs> oh, Oh wow, this is gonna do all the things. Oh, oh wait, you know what I can do? I can put the drain in. Alright, so you only wanna like unscrew it just a little bit and then the rest of the way you're gonna wanna hand loosen it. It's just gonna be an easier time for you. And then it's just gonna come right now. Oh, we missed. Hot oil. I feel it coming. Okay. Alright, so give me that, give me your uh, state of the art. Dude, that looks state of the art, what? The, 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 the thing. <laughs> In English. The, the bucket. God <laughs> damn. Straight up. Yeah, this is, this is shit. <laughs> this man. You guys still with us? Indeed. Good deal. What are you doing? 
This is what you'd use to take off the oil filter. Never mind. Go ahead. Do your thing. Oh, I, I bought this. Thing. <laughs> Real. Cool. You bought something. <laughs> easy. They use like special. That's cool. I've never seen that before. Go ahead. This isn't working. <laughs> Alright, guys, try something else. Let's use. use. Alright, guys, thanks for watching. Please uh, leave a <laughs> like, subscribe to. Uh... <laughs> Where's the little one? We're trying one of these things. We're gonna put it in here. <laughs> so fucking crazy. <laughs> this shouldn't be this hard. Oh, sure. it's working. Isn't it gonna leak everywhere? You need like a towel. No. I see in a video, it's gonna leak everywhere, dude. I don't know what video you watched. Okay, so we gotta put this all the way around. It's a little bib. It's for the pretty baby. small, actually. Yeah, it's a little right. bib for the baby. Just <laughs> covers the whole car in oil. That would not. Would be you funny. be hella mad? I'd be hella after mad. the whole wrap is already done. <laughs> so <laughs> the wrap starts to melt. I would honestly go trade this car, and I'd be done at that point. Come on over to this side, my friend. Well, yeah, I have to show you what's going on. So. Jesus Christ! What are you not down? The car. Oh! <laughs> I missed that noise! It's been so long since I've heard him do that. How does this come out? Germans. Tip for you guys don't buy German. <laughs> are ridiculous. They. They pride themselves on being difficult in any way possible oh, and yeah, making you know. buy thousands of dollars of useless garbage. Stop the shit about the bingo. <laughs> it's gonna look like this, okay? You're gonna unscrew it. It's I already unscrewed it, so it's easy to come out. But basically, you're gonna unscrew it. It's gonna look like this. Where's the O-ring that you said? There's one right there. there. No, there's not. Yeah, there is. Are you sure? It's yes. on there. It might oh yeah, it's probably on there. And then we gotta double check. Let's find out. What is these? Those are these nuts. Ah, got him. No. See, okay, I have a PG thirteen. You know. Roll with it. You're gonna cut out a lot of the stuff I said. Oh, it's just a dream, man. No, just put the. Uh, you don't. The beep sound. You don't. You're not supposed to. Yeah. You want to put it back in with a little bit of oil? Um, I'll I'll go over that in a minute. This wasn't in the other videos. <laughs> it wasn't. Are you sure this? Okay, so the, what he's doing right now is taking off the O-ring. That's something that needs to be done. Um, that just slids off with Nor's broken. Yeah, that, that just that broke. Just happened. It was pretty hilarious, but we weren't recording, unfortunately. Let's not spend like 20 minutes on this one part in the video. I mean. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll cut it. We'll worry. cut it to show like, oh, first try, guys, we did it. Why would you go down? Watch. Mm. You haven't seen a real engineer yet. Bam! That's how you do it, boys. That's how you do it. You go from the top to bottom. And girls. And girls. That was easy. Wait, are you serious? <laughs> that was stupid. What the either. hell? <laughs> Let me put that in there. Let me just put that like that. All right, boys, and that is done. And we gotta get this thingy. No, I wanna see, it's my car, dude. It's, it's my car. I never did it before. It's easier food. It doesn't screw in, you just put it in, right? I guess so. I don't know in German. All right, guys, so I think that's pretty much it. So we're gonna, we're gonna, we put, put this in first. Hey guys, continuing on. So this is a really important step. I don't know if you're supposed to do this for BMWs, but this is what you're supposed to do for any other normal vehicle. Of course, we've already, come to realize the BMW is not a normal vehicle, but basically what you're gonna do, Nor. Yeah. Oh, I got a oil on you. You're gonna wanna do a two-finger dip. Dip it into the old oil. Get up in there. And just put a little lube around it. I'm sorry if I'm sounding sexual. <laughs> um, there's already some in there as well, so it's not gonna be that big of a deal, but it's something that you wanna do with a normal car, because it's just, just I like how he hence his normal car like every two seconds. Well, it's because you're not normal anymore. I look at the seven inch. <laughs> I think that's good. All right. So now, now we're cooking with peanut oil. No, now we gotta put up the screw. <laughs> we lose all our new oil. Oh no! You just start draining it in, and eventually it'll catch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Logic. 
What had happened was when we was down there, the drain plug dropped into here. No way, this is the catch. <laughs> You're supposed to, but you don't always do it. So sometimes you just gotta go fishing a little bit. Okay, well, well before you move, Oh! Before you I figured out the purpose for the washer! Alright, do you wanna get under it and tighten it back down? Not really, he's got this. Mm, this is your car, buddy. I'm okay, I'm, I'm alright. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I mean this needs to be PG-13. Even a PG-13 in the movie is allowed one at one non-sexual F-bomb in the movie. That's it. Yep, guys, now the drain plug's back in. We gotta take the jack stands out and drop the car back on the ground. So I'm gonna jack it up. Nor, you get the jack stands out! Keep going! Yeah, I need to jack a little bit. <laughs> It says 1.25 gallons, no. which I guess converted to five quarts. Quart. Five quarts. Okay, so I'm just gonna drop that in there. I heard consistency is very important. See how much cleaner this oil is than the oil that we've dumped out of it. It's because the oil that we dumped out of it was dog garbage, dog poop, compared to this. That's the part that we equal. Now guys, this is the most important step of all, because what's going to happen if you don't do this You're going to have bad, oil bad everywhere. Stuff, bad stuff's going to happen. Let's just leave it at that. Close it, tighten it, BOOM! You're good to drive. Alright, after the closing the cap, you're big you good boys. Clean the, wash your hands off a little bit here. Alright guys, so we're going to go check our settings right now without turning on the car. We're going to service info. And then uh, I have all these lights from the previous video, which is, um, like I told you guys, hold on. Now it just like froze. One sec, guys. Oh, engine oil level. It's like a, literally a tap for that only. <laughs> and go in there. Hmm. Um. <laughs> <laughs> this says engine oil level okay. No, but what, what is that green thing? I don't know. Why is it only like a quarter? I think it's telling you that so much. <laughs> Dude, drive, drive. But hard part, take that off. Yeah, for real. I blur it. Blur it. 